Hello and welcome back to the Beer Dog Reviews. Now this time we've got a vice beer for you. And I have for you now Vian Stefana. Obviously it's one of the classic vice beers. Picked this one up for £1.85 at the supermarket. It's a 500ml bottle. Obviously it's one of the more well known vice beers. And as they set on the bottle there, the world's oldest brewery from 1516. I do like a nice vice beer. Let's get this one out into the glass. A little bit of smoke on the bottle opening there. Not a massive amount, I have to say. Yeah. Nice old pull. I do find it is important with a vice beer that leave a bit in the bottle so when you top it up you can really get all that sediment and yeast out. Can top it up a bit now. There it is. So Classic vice beer, obviously. Got a nice, solid, good two fingers of crisp, clean white head. Fluffy white head too. Nice, hazy, straw-coloured beer there. Absolutely gorgeous. I mean, looking at it from the bottom, I don't know if you can see on the camera, but from this angle, I can see the carbonation just flying up there. It's really keeping that head full. What a stunning, stunning looking beer. And what more do you want? In a good vice beer, it's got to have that lovely, crisp white head, good hazy straw colour, good carbonation. Now the aroma. Banana, clove, wheat. The three classics for a vice beer, obviously. And there's a real strong banana in there as well. That's that's really good. You're getting the wheat come through right at the end there. The clove and all the different spice mix. That's really... It's just adding another level to that, I think. That is... Oh, a classic vice beer. And I do like a nice vice beer. Oh. Get their taste. It's crisp, it's clean, it's refreshing, it's wheaty, it's malty, it's fruity, it's everything you want from a, a vice beer. So, if you're not really sure what a vice beer is, it's a traditional German wheat beer. This is, in effect, one of the precursors to your lager, but so much more. There's so much flavour packed into that. And uh, as a comparison, you can, across the border into Belgium, you've got your Wit beer. Same thing, you know, it's a beer made with wheat, it's cloudy and golden and pale and crisp. So if you if you like a Belgian Wit beer, it's something like a Hogarden for instance, you'll like this. But for me, this is so much better. It's it's the perfect drink for the summer. It's nice to just sit down, nice cold it's gotta be a pint, isn't it? Nice cold pint of vice beer. Is Vian Stefano my favourite vice beer? No, it's not. But you know what? <laughs> it's a very good one. So, 
under the Bavarian Purity Law of 1516. The brewery itself has been going since 1040. 1040. That's 1980 years. Love to see the uh, documentation, just to back it up a bit, but got no reason to doubt it. And of course, under the purity laws, water, wheat, barley, hops and yeast. Nothing else in there. So that banana flavour, it's not coming from banana, the malty richness is coming from the malt and that gives you that fruity banana taste. That clove spice, that's not coming from an adjunct at all, it's all from the brewing process. Tang of bitterness on the back end, got that bready flavour right in the middle, and that fruity spicy kick but at the front end there. That good carbonation, that really pushes that beer right round the mouth, opens up all of those flavours. So you get every last drop of flavour from that one bottle. I can't believe that anyone hasn't had it, but if you haven't, you may be new to different styles of beer, you may be new to beer. Do grab yourself a Weinstavana or any good vice beer. Trust me, you will not regret it. And £1.85 for that beats paying two to three pound for a, a pint of generic lager in the pub, doesn't it? Or maybe that's just me. So, there it is. Fine Stefana Hefe Weissbier. It's their traditional Weissbier. They do do some different styles, but this Bavarian style is a classic in my eyes. Absolutely gorgeous. Cheers to you all. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe down there and do check out some of my other videos, recommend me some other beers and I'll see you all again next time. Happy drinking!